Hey guys, the Superfar5 here, and I'm going to make another how to video, and this is how to chain on Pokemon Pearl, Diamond, and Platinum. Let us get started with the setup, what you need. Go ahead and go to your bag, and you should register your Poke Radar. To do that, just click on it and push register. I'll set it to your Y button, so you just have to click your Y button. Um, another thing you'll need is a lot, a lot of super repels. I have 217 here, but feel free to buy way more. You'll need at least 100 plus. I'm not kidding. Now, what you also should need is a Pokemon that has high PP or power points. Here I have my Torterra. It has Razor Leaf 40, Crunch 24, and Earthquake 16. Now, um, that'll make a total of around uh, 62 around there, but um, just get a Pokemon with high power points. Now, you all, uh, you should uh, notice that I use Torterra a lot just because um, in all my chaining videos, uh, you see my Torterra there. Now, since you have the Poke Radar Pokemon with high PP and a lot of super repels, go ahead and set one. You could go to any patch of grass, but make sure it's huge. It should cover pretty much all the screen on your DS. Now, go ahead and click on your Pokey Radar, which I set to Y. A bunch of grass will shake. There's a bunch of uh, grass you could choose, but just choose one. Now, I choose one with very little shake. It's a normal patch. Oh, pff, there's a Geodude. <laughs> chain of 127 that um, remember the patch you went into there's numerous types of patches you could go to there's a one with a rough shake and one with a very little shake I chose one with a very little shake so remember that now if you want to continue the sh uh, chain go ahead and attack it or throw a pokeball you can do whatever one you want, but um, I caught you, dude, so I'm going to attack it. And that will continue the chain. Now, if you run away, your chain will be broken no matter what. So, go ahead and take that out. More grass will shake. Now, if you remembered your chain well, um, you will know what kind of patch of grass uh, you are looking for. Now, what you want is the patch that's four steps away from you. That's four, okay? Not three, not two, not one, but four. Four steps away. And, and right there, uh, on the edge of the grass there, um, do not go on any, any patch of grass near the edge. Do not even think about it. You're just looking for trouble. Now, there was a patch of grass that was four steps away that was exactly mine right up here. Now, this is next to the edge. Not exactly. This continues my chain to two. Trust me, I got lucky there. Usually you'll just have to keep looking, keep looking. Also, do not get impatient and just go into a patch of grass that you're not sure of. You have to be absolutely positive that is the patch of grass you should go into. Do not second guess. So there we go, my chain is up to two now. More patches of grass shakes. Nothing here that is four steps away is in my uh, grass pretty much. There's a shaking grass right here which was four steps away from where I was but it was a uh, rough shake grass. It's not the same. So what you have to do is keep just doing this avoiding all grass. Do not go into the grass that's shaked. That's not yours. And four steps away. Okay there was a grass up here that's four steps away but it wasn't my grass. It's not the same, so keep going. This requires a lot of patience, okay? Chaining is very hard and um, my repel wore off. You'll be doing this a lot, 
So go ahead and bring your repels to the very front if you want. That's what I did. And just keep going. Now a chain usually until you get to 40. If you get to 40, that is when you want to stop encountering and start just um Okay, there we go. This one is four steps away, one, two, three, four, and two steps down. But I did my four already, so this is going to continue my chain. And it's not near an edge. My chain is three now. Now, must attack. Do not run away from these. There you go. Take that geodude down and continue your chain. This could be a very slow and painful process and could be pretty devastating if it breaks at around 30. But your patience will be rewarded with the shiny you want. Now there's a bunch of grass that's shaped but nothing in my, uh, nothing that I really want. So just move out of the way and keep going. Now, another thing, if you go out of the area or out of the grass, your chain will break automatically. Do not do that, please. Stay in the grass. Okay, this one is four patches away. It looks like mine, so here we go. My chain is extended to four. Do not get hasty again. Reset your pokey radar if necessary. Do not be unpatient, please. This is a patient process you need to take. So um, once you get to 40, stop encountering uh, and start looking for the shiny patch. I'm going to put a video on my description of this video showing a live shiny patch. And this one's four steps away too. My gosh, it's five. This is a fast chain. <laughs> I'll put a video, um, one of my videos of uh, Starly. Actually, no, I'll do my Geodude video and uh, show you what a life shiny patch look like. And look for it, okay? Once you get to 40, stop what you're doing and just reset your Pokey Radar till you get the shiny patch. And in that patch, you will get a shiny, the one you're looking for. This is already a seven minute video, so I'm pretty much done here. Avoid patches, uh, one more thing, avoid patches that are together. If they shake right next to each other, don't go for it. Even if, it, even if it's your patch and very close to you, well, um, and four steps away, still do not go into it. You have been warned. <laughs> um, look for missed outbreaks, as um, those give you a higher chance of encountering the Pokemon that you're looking for. So if you make a mistake, you could still get it because it's so common. That's pretty much it, guys. That's pretty much the beauty of Pokey Radar. You just have to be patient with this stuff. This could take you forever, 40 to an hour, at the least. Yeah, that's four steps away. It's not my patch, though, so I'm not going for it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope I taught you a lot. If you have more questions, please comment, because I will be sure to answer them. Um, subscribe, like, and comment. The video of the live patch that you will be looking for is in the description of this video. So um, go ahead and look for that. And I'm Z Superfire 5. Hope you guys enjoyed again. And I will see you guys later.